Well, Justin, good to have you on the show. Yeah, thanks for having me. I've been looking forward to it. Well, the big rivalries coming up in football, of course, OSU and Michigan. And uh, so we wanted to get your take of uh, where you think things are going to go. Well, I'm, I'm excited for the game. Uh, first and foremost, uh, I think Michigan's had a great year uh, by their standards. And coming down to that Saturday in November, that last Saturday, it's, you know, you can kind of throw out the records and all that because the rivalry is, is the best in the country and both teams are going to come to play. But this Ohio State offense, this Ohio State team has found a way all year long. And I think they continue to here come, come Saturday. What do you think their strengths are and what do you think our weaknesses are and vice versa? Yeah, I kind of look at Michigan as a, a Georgia light. Um, they're not as good as Georgia, but they got a good, strong defense that's been playing well this year, and they have a real strong run game. Um, so I, I think that's going to be a good test for us to see. And, and you know, that's kind of going against our run defense, which has been you know hit and miss this year. But we're going to have to play strong. And uh, you know, then our, on our offensive side, yeah, we're going against you. They're a good defense, but they haven't seen weapons like Ohio State has with all of our receivers. And then you throw Henderson and you know Mayan Williams into it and CJ. I mean, a few weeks ago, uh, you know, against Purdue, he had probably one of his best games that I, I think he's played this year. So he's riding high right now. The team has a lot of confidence. And uh, you know, I, I think we're going to be too much for Michigan to handle. Do you think uh, because it's a way that they're going to have an advantage with it being in their own court? Uh, you typically like to think that you have that home field advantage, right? Gosh, 2018, 2019, we went up there, 62 to 39 or whatever it was. So I, I don't know that they have the home field advantage. A lot of that is with how the game goes, in, in my opinion, as well. Um, you know, if we come out slow, they get a couple of big stops, they get a score, you know, the crowd's going to be into it. If we get the ball right away and go down the field and put seven up on them, you know, that has a way of quieting the crowd. So, you know, it's all about that start, and you want to, always want to start fast in, in a rivalry game and, uh, you know, try and take that crowd out of it. But I, I don't think it's going to be an issue for, for the Buckeyes. Well, give us your prediction. What do you think final score? Oh, well, I mean, going into last year when we didn't get to play the game, you heard a lot about Ryan Day wanting to drop 100 on them. Um, I want to say it's going to be that, but, uh, you yeah, know, I, I think we're looking somewhere in the 55 to 21 range. I, I think if Ohio State has everybody healthy, you know, going into the game, you got a whole week of practice to get through and whatnot. If they're healthy, they're going to be ready to rock. They've been licking their chops to get a chance at Michigan. Fantastic. Well, great analysis, Justin. Really appreciate you being on the show. Thank you. Thank you.